People always told me I need someone like you Someone who gets me and someone who's cool, yeah And I like the way you are And now I want it all Okay, so we need to give you guys an update. We know that it's been over hot, a month. A hot minute. <laughs> a hot month. A long a hot minute since we made a video. In fact, I just looked. I think it said 37 days or something since we posted our last video wow. on here. And you've been making some videos talking yeah. about some things that, that we've done yeah. on your channel. But I've been basically uh, focusing on the Halloween channel. And our internet here is horrible. It's it's so slow to Very upload. Bad. It's been taking like six hours to upload one video. So um, making videos for two channels is just not in the cards right now. <laughs> I'm skipping the Halloween video today to make this video. So basically we need to rewind and backtrack and talk to you guys about everything that's been going on up to this point, um, at least up to Ohio. Because we're in rainy Ohio right now. Mm. And what's it been doing, babe, the whole rainy. time we've been here? Raining, snowing, <laughs> sleet, more yeah. rain. We yep. have two sunny days so far in a month that we've mm -hmm. been here. Almost a month that we've been here. Except for when it rains all day or snows all day. And then all of a sudden at 7 p.m. it becomes yeah, summer comes out. for a half right. an hour. Right. <laughs> so it's so, Ohio is so weird. Um, okay, so let's back Let's back way up to, let's go all the way back to Florida, mm. when we first got to Florida. We'll skim through those. All right. Because you, if you guys have been watching, you know what's been happening. You can skim through them, because I don't remember a thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is going to be really interesting, so you might not want to click off of here <laughs> if you start getting bored, because there's just been so much crap. Mm. Um <clears throat> I don't know, so much that we've done. So anyways, let's just go all the way back to um, when we first got to Royal Coachman. Um, we went to Royal Coachman in... Na, 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 na. Nokomis. Nokomis, Florida. Mm -hmm. And we were there for one month. Um, you may remember some of this stuff because we have had some videos because we're you know going to talk about the slides here a little bit. Um, mm -hmm. We were there for a month. I had bad gout in my foot mm -hmm. for two to three weeks. Mm -hmm. It's been under control ever since then. As soon as it left, I have not had another gout um, attack. Thank God. Thank God. So we've been good with that. Because um, I've been given them vitamins and supplements. <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, um, <laughs> so we we had the problems with the slides when we left Nokomis. Um, you guys know that we took the RV in when we got to Homosassa. Mm -hmm. um, Crystal River, and it sat in there for a month getting fixed. Oh, yes. When we got it back, it's we, all it coming still back wasn't to me fixed. Now. Yeah, we were in that <laughs> shack with all the ants. And, yeah, and Christmas. I, and here's the thing, guys. I, I might talk about a lot of things that you guys don't even know about that we have filmed, and I think I've posted, because really, over this past couple of months here, we've filmed a lot of stuff that I never posted, because a lot of times it's like partial vlogs mm -hmm. that I never finish, and I don't, I don't know, I have a lot of footage, so maybe I'll just be inserting stuff here as we talk, I'll put it like right here as we talk, so anyways. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah, we were at um, Homosassa uh -huh. for a month, uh -huh. getting the, the slides fixed, when it came time to leave, the slides... Were they fixed at that point? They, they were pretty much fixed. They were fixed, but they... They gave us more problems. Yeah, we had to get that thing. Yeah. That thing that you... Had. Yeah, where did we go into the... Oh, Panama City Panama Beach. City. We went to Panama City Beach. But let's go back to Home Assassin. The only thing that kept us going there was a golf cart. <sighs> we rented a golf cart so we Lord. could tool around. Thank and you, Lord, have for a little, the golf cart. Have a little fun with that. And um, Christmas, we had... a pretty decent christmas it was we had decorations yeah you guys helped us through christmas all yes, those cards did. and everything yes 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 <laughs> yes so panama city beach um we had an awesome <clears throat> site i i pretty sure we showed you guys but i don't remember it was right on this big pond mm -hmm. um probably the best site <clears throat> at the whole yeah, park yeah it was gorgeous the Sunsets, wind was crazy though sunrises sun 
Yeah. I think the sunset was in front of us. Yeah, every night we got to see the sunset, and um, yes. it was just, it was beautiful. <clears throat> and the wind, um, the wind. But then it got really windy, it got really cold, we got sick. Is that where um, we got the uh, co where we had COVID? Yep, that's where we had we, we had, had the COVID. The COVID. We had the COVID. Um, a very mild case of the COVID. If that was mild, I don't want to see a <laughs> bad case. And, and, and well, we that were was mild. miserable. Yeah. Yeah, I mean the bad cases actually end up in the dead. hospital or dead. So, right, right. You know, it was very mild. So, yep. anyways, then halfway through that, we went over to the other side of the park for another month, mm -hmm. um, and we were in just an okay spot. Yeah. Um, was that I don't a think. Month we were yeah, it was another month. month because that's where we went to the zoo. Oh yeah, and we did post a video of that zoo. Uh -huh. If you haven't seen that, you can go back to look. Um, you got to actually go in and hold a the, the heck kangaroo, was that? the roo, the baby roo, the baby and roo that and little um, oh capybara, capybara. Yeah, a rodent of unusual size. Yeah, it was a baby <laughs> one. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So was, and there was cute. there was more to do in Panama City Beach. But we never did it. I mean, there was like this giant thing called Wonderworks. It was a big upside down building. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what was in it, but it was some kind of a uh, entertainment park or something. Across the street from that was, what was it? Ripley's. Ripley's, Ripley's. believe it or not. It was like a giant Titanic boat sticking out of the ground. And mm -hmm. we never made it in there either. I, I don't know. We were just, we did we make just it weren't to the feeling beach. it. Yeah, we, get, we went to the beach a couple times, just walked out on it and walked back in. Yeah, but we went to the restaurant on the beach, remember yeah. that, a couple of times, and that was just amazingly mm -hmm. beautiful. And I did put and a video on it. the food was good, too. I believe that, yeah. The food was very good, and I did video, put a video up on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, it must be, oh, somebody pulling through one of these sites. Yeah. We're, we're, everything's gravel out here, so we hear every car that drives through. Five o'clock in the morning. Ugh. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's, we haven't been to one park yet except for Royal Coachman. Since Royal Coachman, every park we've been to has had construction going on. Mm -hmm. So every morning, early in the morning, we're hearing this beep, 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 but the truck's backing up. And, mm -hmm. and the truckers going out to their jobs outside the park, wherever. Yeah. And the crunching of the tires going over the yep. stones. And then here, there's um, there's a lot of geese. It's tough to be retired. Pardon me. And work from home. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of geese here, and 11 o'clock at night, they start honking. I don't know why. I don't know what it is 11 o'clock at night, but they start honking. So anyways, uh -huh. getting ahead of ourselves here. Um, Back to Panama City Beach. Um, When we finally left there, there, okay, there's things I have to not include about what was going on, because it has, that we'll talk about it later. <laughs> um, it's all good but we left panama city beach let's see we were sick there um oh let's talk about that that um park in panama city beach it was called well it used to be called emerald coast mm -hmm. when we got there they were in the process of changing it they changed it to like sun outdoors i think sun, yeah yeah really nice park um but again, there was construction going on, so it was constant construction in the park, constant sounds of construction, starting at like 3.30 in the morning. Um, and there were some weird things about the park. The laundry, like, at Royal Coachman, that seems to be my, at least my favorite park Mine we've too. been to. Royal Coachman has a giant laundromat on site that has probably... 20, Man, 20 to 25 washers, washers and 25 and dryers. dryers. And, I mean, it's huge, and it's exactly how it should be. It, have t it has tables that you can fold on, mm -hmm. um, a TV you can watch if you want to, magazines, chairs yeah. to sit in. This yeah. place had three very small laundromats, each with four washers and four dryers. Mm -hmm. um, and you never go in there with just one washer's worth of clothes. I mean, we you'd have to anyway. do you'd have to do your laundry every other day to do that. <laughs> yeah. So if you go in and somebody else is using them, you just have to wait. So we then end up hopping these things to find one that had enough washers for us. Um, mm -hmm. That was probably the biggest pain in the butt. Everything else seemed to be pretty good with that park. Mm -hmm. We really liked that park. Uh, oh, and I had the zoo, <laughs> that zoo that we went to. Yeah. That was another thing. Oh, we talked about this when we did our, 
um, our one year anniversary thing. Mm -hmm. We talked about all the sounds of that park. Right. And part of it was that the zoo was on the one border side of it. And you could hear all these animals. I don't even know what they were, if they were donkeys or horses or goats or birds. It probably was every single one of them. And then there was a lady riding around on a little motorized cart oh, in the park right. yes. who had a, a bird. What do you call that thing? Um, um, heck it a, wasn't a parrot. It was a... I don't know, some it kind was of like a, big a cockatiel, bird. but a huge one. Yeah. And we think what was happening was that every morning that thing would start squawking and get everything at the zoo going. Mm -hmm. So it was mm -hmm. pretty crazy. It would ride around on her shoulder. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so when we left Panama City Beach, we were heading to Louisiana. Did mm -hmm. we leave? Mm -hmm. I think we left early. So that we yeah. could make it a two-day trip instead of one, because it was a pretty long drive. So we stopped, didn't we? No, we didn't. We didn't I think stop we went to a Cracker Barrel on yeah. the way. Yeah. Yeah. Chrissy's like way yeah. out of the way yeah, from no. there. We met her in Louisiana. Yeah. So this was the end <coughs> of February. We left like a day early from that park in Panama City, and we went to um, a Cracker Barrel in Alabama. I think mm -hmm. it was. Now let me think. We actually may have taken. I think we only took two days to get there. I mean, like, you know, one night in a Cracker Barrel, the next day we were in Louisiana. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm, I don't remember exactly the park that we were, I mean, the, the Cracker Barrel we were at. But I don't think it was the shady one. I think no. that one was was later on. Yeah. Because we stopped there for a night. Then we went to um, Louisiana to Pochet's. Mm -hmm. That's a park that I've stayed at three or four times now. The first park that I ever stayed at down there when I met her and we got married. Um, and it was a really nice park then. It was it was a great park. Second time we stayed, it was a great park. This time, it was really weird. We went in, we signed in, and the girl would not crack a smile at the front desk. And she slaps a bracelet on us. Like a concert-going paper bracelet thing. I'm like, what in the world is this? And... Then she put one on her, and she said, you got to wear these at all times. We're going to be there for two weeks. And I was just like, as soon as we got in the, in the RV from checking in, we cut them off. <laughs> the thing is, when we go to like other parks, when we go like in the spring or summer, they, gate, they give you bands to wear for the, for the pool. And you can put them yeah. on then. But you don't have to wear them 24-7. But Pochette... Yeah. They wanted you to. Yeah, it's like if you're going to go out and do something in the park, attend something that's in the park, you put the bracelet mm -hmm. on. But this, they expected you to have them on the whole time. She said, if you mm -hmm. take a shower or anything and it falls off, come back, we'll give you another one. We're like, snip. <laughs> <laughs> we never used we them. We never used it. We never put one back on. Nobody ever said anything. Yeah, and then... I don't know. I mean, it was a totally different feeling the last couple times that I was there. But this time, I don't know if they were bought by a different by different people, new owners or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, but there were, like, kids running around on golf carts. It's a one-way circle all the way around. Oh, that's right. And that only applies to vehicles. Well, well, cars. It doesn't apply to them on their golf carts. Or people staying there on their golf carts. They can go as fast as they want in any direction they want. Right. Which was insane. And it's a one lane circle. So, like, here's the pond. Then you got one lane drive. Everybody parks like this with their RVs. The one lane drive here. And then there's a drop off onto somebody else's property over here. So you can't, like, go around if there's mm -hmm. a car there. Mm -hmm. There was a truck who was backing his RV in, his fifth wheel. And so we couldn't go around because he's, like stopped like this across the thing. And he's getting in and out to check and make sure he's doing yeah. this right. And and you you, you don't hurry somebody. No. When they're hooking up or no. unhooking, right. you don't hurry them. You don't bother them. You don't talk to them anything because it can cause big problems, you know? Right. Um, and I mean with hooking up and stuff. I don't just mean with somebody with their attitude. No, right. But, you know, they forget something and they try to drive away. Their whole rig drops down and, you know, problems. So... So we sat there waiting for a minute and she had an appointment. So I'm like, er, you know, go to turn around. So we went the wrong way. Yeah. We're going the opposite direction, the wrong way. This dude on a cart zips up to us and tells us we're going the wrong way. 
And I said, well, there's a truck over here where you can't get around. He's like, you have to wait. I'm like, we'll wait next time. And I took off. <laughs> and then he must have radioed another guy because somebody else stopped us on the way down, too. He was adamant, though. No, 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 no. You, no, yeah. you cannot. No, you cannot. <laughs> well, we have an appointment. See you later. Bye. So, yeah. So then we got out there. Somebody else stopped us. And we said the same thing. You know, we got nice an appointment. nice about it. Next he was time. nice about it. Yeah. The other guy was not. He yeah. was like... That's his job, and he took it seriously. Yeah, he is like 16 years old or something. <laughs> anyways, so um, that was like the negative part of being at Poche's. We went and had a surprise birthday party for me. Mm -hmm. um, walked in, and, and Marion had like all this food from, where was it? Olive Garden? Yeah. Olive Garden food, mm -hmm. tons of stuff there. Lasagna. Lots of people. It was It was pretty fun. Um, let's see, what else? Oh, the fish. There's also a Poche's Market. And Whoa. it used to be related to Poche's Park, but apparently it's two different things now. Mm -hmm. Man, they had some good fish there. It was catfish. Mm. And usually I'm just straight up beer batter cod. That's my thing. But she went out to do something. What, get your nails or something done? Something. And came back and was like, I'm bringing back Poche's. Hair. I had my hair done. Uh, okay, yeah. And brought back this fish. Um, breaded. What, was, what did I say? Um, it was catfish. catfish. Breaded catfish. And there was like rice. And then there was something else with it. Mac and cheese, uh, maybe? Mac and cheese. But it was on, jam wasn't it jambalaya rice? Or no? Something like that. I yeah. don't know. I don't, I don't know jambalaya. those Cajun jambalaya. words. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> what else did you say? Mac and cheese. Mac oh. and cheese. It was so good. I think we went back there three times. <laughs> we did. Uh, something like that. Thank so. for it now. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, so that was that was Louisiana. And then we got on the road to head back to Ohio. We went to Cracker Barrel? Barrels Cracker Barrel? in Alabama. And mm -hmm. that was a really sketchy one because there was like a, a hotel right up against the parking lot over a fence mm -hmm. and people hanging around there that I was like, are we really going to stay here or what? So we stayed. There was a big fence between us. So yeah. it wasn't that bad. Yeah. We stayed. We didn't have any problems, yeah. but mm -hmm. I think it was only the second Cracker Barrel that we'd gone to that was really felt kind of uncomfortable, you know? Mm. Um, then we went to, where did we go after that? Um, not Kentucky yet. Okay. Maybe the next day we went. I think we stayed at two Cracker Barrels on our way to Tennessee. Oh, that's right, because we stopped to see Patrick. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Stopped at Patrick's, and we so, stayed there a night. Saw him and what? Alex, and what's the other guy's name? I forgot. His, if his you hadn't asked one. me, I'd remember. I know, I know. Um, but anyway, so <laughs> we stayed there for the night. Bill. 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 And then we went from Tennessee to Kentucky. Old oh, Kentucky. <laughs> Kentucky. <laughs> but by the time we got to Kentucky, uh, we were both exhausted from driving so much. And I, I didn't even know where that came from. But it was like something my dad would say. <laughs> but we drove through, like we passed the sign for Kentucky. And I was like, Old oh, Kentucky. <laughs> and we were just cracking up laughing. Um... So I'm trying to think if there was anything that happened, like, in any of these parking lots or along the way. And I don't think so. When we got to Kentucky, so. we stopped at a KOA, mm -hmm. um, a campground. We got there just as they closed the doors to the to the, the store. So we didn't get any, like, hot dogs or anything. I remember we wanted some hot dogs or something. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Stayed there for the night. And then I think we took off to Ohio. Mm -hmm. And it never fails. You think the drive is going to be like three, four hours, and it turns out being like six ten. or seven. <laughs> From Kentucky to Ohio was ten hours. I was so tired of driving. I don't know. I didn't know you were exhausted just from riding. Mm -hmm. So it's funny how that works. Entertaining you. I had to entertain you. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. I know there was like more stuff in between there. Things that I, I probably filmed along the way. And mm -hmm. like I said, you know, if, if I did, I inserted them in here and you guys have seen them. <clears throat> so it's just, it's just been kind of crazy. Of course, when we got to Ohio here, we got to visit, 
you know, the rest of the family. Mm -hmm. um, and we'll pick up with the rest of the story in our next video. Um, but we are in Ohio right now. And yeah, like we were saying, it's, look at this. Right now we got the sun yeah. out. It's yep. like, it seems like a really nice sunny day. It's but, warm though. You got to say that. Yeah, it's, it's warm. It's in the 70s. So yeah. that's a, that's a switch because mm -hmm. it's been cold old. Yeah. Half an hour ago, it was raining. Mm -hmm. We've had snow, ice, sleet. sleet. All in one day. All um, in one hail. afternoon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've had hail. We had hail that was not quite the size of a marble, but it was about half that size yeah, at least. It was, yeah. 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 Um, mm. that's, that's Ohio at this time of year. It's crazy. We did end up having a fire the other night, so that was the nice. first one in months. Yeah. Right? Yep, that first one cold. in months. <laughs> That was, uh, we put a picture up on Facebook, I think, with me and my new, my hat and scarf. <laughs> <laughs> it has been different weather. Never experienced this before. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> like all four seasons each day. Mm -hmm. So, oh, we also, um, my internet, when we got, I don't know, it was sometime on our drive on our way to Ohio. We have this Nomad internet, and for the most part, for us, it's been good. A lot of people have a lot of problems with it, though. They emailed me one day and said something like, due to our provider's um, requirements, we have to swap out the hotspot, the router. Mm -hmm. Nothing else, no way to get back in contact with them or anything. Get, getting in contact with them is impossible. Um... They followed it up by shutting off my internet and sending another email that said, your order's been processed. Mm -hmm. And then it was almost a month before we got the new router. And I had to keep asking them and harassing them. And they'd say, it's going out the next day. And it was crazy. We finally got that. Um, and, and we have two routers. One of them is from, like, I don't know, the other RV thing, family RV oh. something or other. I don't know. But that one doesn't mm -hmm. work very well here either, because we're surrounded by trees. So, anyways, man, just telling the story, I'm I know, exhausted. It's exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> we were just going to do this live, but like I said, the internet's not the greatest here. So I don't even think that it would have held the stream. Yeah. So. we got some good stuff coming up, so... Yeah, we got a lot of other stuff to talk about too, things to um to tell you guys about, but we're not quite ready yet. Um What about so, Courtney? We can tell them about Courtney. Yeah. Uh Nate's daughter had her baby. Mm-hmm. Eight pounds, one ounce, nineteen inches long. Reagan Noel. Yep. So cute. Yep. So, so, so cute. now we have the little, the tiny, and the, the teeny. teeny. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So I know my my son's fiance is due in, I think, June. So that's mm -hmm. coming up also. And my grandson's wife is due in July. So that's coming up. Yeah. So it's it, it, it been a being pretty born. busy time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, lots of stuff going on. Yeah. So. We've been going to church with uh, mom and dad, mm -hmm. Rambod. And Mom and Dad Rambod. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And it's great. Um, we all get along really good. So mm -hmm. Kelly and Zach and then Buddy. Yeah. Buddy yeah. is uh, Kelly and Zach's son and then Grace. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yep. It's been nice. It's been nice being able to go to church, physically go to church. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. So... Yeah, I don't know. There's, I know there's lots of other stuff that we left out. Probably. But I don't even know. It's just been such a whirlwind. And, uh, you know, that's it. So. <laughs> yeah. But I'm going to get back into doing some uh, makeup uh, videos and some subscription videos and try-ons. So, yeah. That's happening. I like those try-on videos. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway. 
Okay, so I guess that's it for this video, guys. We just wanted to give you an update. Mm -hmm, that we're fine. We're doing yeah. well. Yep. No, nothing's bad is happening. Um, we're just internet problems and just other stuff going on. So mm -hmm. stay tuned because there's stuff coming up. Yeah. So I guess that's it. <laughs> and... Now I'm going to go edit this video. It'll be up in about 18 hours. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, that's all it. Right. Say goodbye. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs> People always told me I need someone like you, someone who gets me and someone who's cool.